Hello everybody, this is Christopher again with Radio Gaming, and today on the Retroid Pocket 2, we're going to go back and play some Atari 7800 games. So first off, we'll go ahead and go into the Android menu, and we're going to go into Retro. And let's go ahead and load the core. And go to content. Let's see. Let's go ahead and start with pole position two. It's a game I always enjoyed playing. Prepare to qualify. Got Mount Fuji in the background there. Crash. So it runs really good. <clears throat> Acceleration is B, brakes A, and controls work fine. The D-pad on this system I really do enjoy. It feels really nice to use. It's got a little curvature in the middle. But overall, it's a lot of fun to play. And pole position 2 is always a great game. Game over. <clears throat> All right, let's go ahead and close that and let's load up something else. Load content, start directory Atari. And let's go ahead and... Let's go and play Dick Dog. That plays great. I'm just messing around. No complaints at all with this. And it's a, it's an old Atari game, so there really should be no issues at all. I'd never expected any to have any problems here, but you never know. So it plays really good. The screen quality, I know it doesn't always translate well on video, but it is a beautiful screen. I really do like it and I'm impressed with what they put in there. And for this being only $80, it really is a good system. So, again, the back of it, the games I'm showing right now, you don't really use all the controls, but you do have the four shoulder bu buttons here to go with the four face buttons. You have the start, select, and home, two thumb pads, thumbsticks, and you get the D-pad as well. So Dig Dug looks good, plays good, sounds fine. Let's go ahead and load up one more and just take a look. Load content, start directory, we're going back to the Atari. And since I showed it on the earlier one on Atari, let's go ahead and load up a Pac-Man game. And we're going with Mrs. Pac-Man this time. Or, sorry, Ms. Pac-Man. She's not married, or we don't know yet. Looks a lot better than the earlier version. Plays a lot better too. A lot smoother.
Oh, I'm stuck. <laughs> Let's go ahead and finish out this level. So that was in this Pac-Man on the Atari 7800. But it runs great. Sounds great. Graphics are, I mean, just as you'd expect from this game. And there you go. So, really enjoyable to play. Um, but all the game, older games especially are on this system. But if you have any questions, concerns, comments, anything else you'd like to see on here, please just leave a comment there. I'll do my best to accommodate all requests. But just if you do like it, please like and subscribe. It keeps me going. Let's me know that people actually do enjoy it. But the system itself, I love it. If you give it a chance. Uh, if you do want to take a look at it more to buy one, uh, the manufacturer's website is goretroid.com. I'll leave a link in the description. And you can go ahead and get one yourself. They are still $80 right now plus shipping. Uh, they did start shipping the first pre-order batch already. So those that have ordered them in the past should be getting them soon. And it usually takes about a couple weeks after they ship it for you to receive the system itself. But again, this is the Retroid Pocket 2. My name is Christopher with 3 Gaming, and you guys have a wonderful day. Take care. Bye.